Hi, my name is John Kern. I'm with the Maryland Volunteer Lawyer Service, and I wanted to do a quick video on estate debt liability. So this isn't legal advice, but I just want to talk through a few of the ins and outs with debt liability. So if somebody passes away, we get a question often from the family and friends that are handling that estate, whether or not they can be personally held responsible for the debts of their deceased relatives. And the short answer is no. So what happens is, after someone passes away, all of their assets, everything they have, is kind of floating in limbo between them and the folks that are supposed to get it. Now, when it's there, when it's in the estate like that, creditors have, some creditors, have six months to file a claim against the estate. So if the parents had credit card debt or something, those debt collectors have a six-month window in which they've got to file a claim to try to get part of that estate, the estate. So oftentimes, it's, it might be a good idea to wait six months to open that estate, and it can shield from some debts, not all of them, but some. The personal representative who's handling the estate is in no way personally responsible for paying any of those debts. The only folks that might um, have some responsibility there is if they co-signed on a loan. And in that way, that loan does still stay attached to the person that's still alive, okay? Um, other types of debts um, that may have a claim, if, if it's a claim from the United States or from the state of Maryland, there's no limit on when they can file the claim against the estate, okay? Um, and also, if the deceased had any uh, Medicaid benefits, Medicaid can also uh, file a claim against the state. They're not restricted by that six-month deadline. Um, so the best thing that we can do is actually set it up where you're actually avoiding this probate process. So with your bank accounts, you can file a payable upon death, and that'll pass money directly to the next generation, um, and also a, um, a transfer on death at the NBA, and that's going to move your car around probate and also shield it from those deaths. It's going to go right to that next person. Um, so just be thinking, really, the big takeaway is... Um, Folks that are handling the estate are not directly responsible for that debt. It's the estate of the folks that passed away. But there are some timing issues for those people making a claim against that estate. And then the remaining money will be divvied out either through following the direction of the will or through the probate process with the, with the estate if there is no will. Um, but the best thing we can do is to do our estate planning, get ahead of this, and make sure everybody knows where the money's going and that all the mechanisms to pass that money are in place so that this happens as seamlessly as possible. Thanks so much.